The first number of today is 105. This is the number of pages in a report on racial bias in the Ferguson Police Department released by the Justice Department yesterday. Now, all week long, we've spoken about some of the findings from the report and their impact. The details were leaked by the Justice Department to the press in advance, but now we have the actual text of what they discovered, and we put up copies of the report on our Facebook page and our Google Plus page. But the bottom line is that the Ferguson Police Department behaved like a racist goon squad in a totalitarian state rather than the United States of America. Some of the most egregious examples include the fact that everyone attacked by a police dog in Ferguson was black, including a 14-year-old boy who was bitten and then beaten on the floor of an abandoned house where he was waiting for his friends. Police also randomly stopped, detained, and arrested people without cause and then later on made up the charges for having done so and also made bogus traffic violation stops and then fined people and then threatened to jail them if they didn't pay up. And according to the Justice Department, this was all to raise money for the city of Ferguson by preying on its black citizens. And all of this is also the reason why Attorney General Eric Holder yesterday said that Ferguson protesters had been, quote, right, close quote. But the question is that with 18,000 other police departments across the country, how many other Fergusons are there?